Hello and welcome to Quick Tips, the WooCommerce video series. In this video, we will install a free plugin which will give you an option to set up FAQ section on each product page of a WooCommerce website. So this is one of the product page and here you will see the FAQ section added on this product page. So you can set up the FAQ for each product. If you have any common question which can be applied for all the products on your website, you can also set up the global FAQ and this global FAQ can be applied to all the products easily. So you do not need to type in the same questions for each product. So here you will see the option FAQs and here you can set up the question and answer for each product. So let's see how we can install this free FAQ plugin for WooCommerce. Do not forget to subscribe to Quick Tips YouTube channel. Watch new videos about website design, e-commerce websites, search engine optimization, social media marketing, WordPress tutorials, video editing tips, and many more. Press the bell icon to get instant notification whenever we publish new videos. So here I'm logged into the dashboard of the WordPress website and we are using WooCommerce on this website. Now we are going to install a free plugin which will give you an option to set up frequently asked questions on each product of the WooCommerce website. So let's go to plugins and click on add new. And here search for WPC product FAQ for WooCommerce. So this is the plugin that we are going to install WPC product FAQs for WooCommerce. Click on install now. Click on activate. All right, so the plugin has been activated and here you will see the option WP Clever and under that you will see product FAQs. In one of the videos, I have installed the product timer plugin for WooCommerce and this is the product FAQs. Click on it. Now here you will see the option global FAQs. Global FAQs will can be used for each product. So you do not need to type in the same FAQs for each product. You can set up some global FAQs which you can select for each product. So let me set up one global FAQ here. So we are going to add the first global FAQ. So click on add new. And this will be common question. Who will deliver the product? These are some dummy questions that I am setting up. This is the general question. So click on publish. Go to product FAQs. So if you want to add any other general question, you can click on add new and add another FAQ. Now let's go to products. So let's go to one of the product. This is the product. Let me show you the product first. So this is how the product looks. Now let's go to the edit section of this product. Edit product. Now here you will see the option FAQs. Click on it. If you want to select the global FAQ, you can simply select this global FAQ and click on add new. And type in some letters of that particular question. So I'm going to select for deliver. And this was the question who will deliver the product. So select that one. So this question will be shown in the FAQ. Now if I want to add some custom FAQs for this product. So click on cus. So from here select custom FAQ and click on add new FAQ. And here you can set up the title. So this is the question for this product. If you want to add one more, you can select custom FAQ, click on add new. So this is the question, is color long lasting? Yes, it is. So this is your answer. If you want to add one more, you can select custom FAQ and click on add new. Can I order two at a time? Yes, you can. So these are the dummy questions that I'm setting up. Now click on update. Now let's view the product. So if you scroll down, you will see the option added here FAQs. And these are the questions. So this is the first question that was from the global FAQ. And these are the three questions that we added on the product page. So let's see if you want to change the location of these FAQs, you can also move them up and down. So this is the first question. I'm going to make it 
at the end or I want this one at the top so I can rearrange the position of these questions also and once rearranged you can click on update and click on refresh so you will see that the position of the question is changed so this is how you can show the FAQ section on a product page of WooCommerce website. So that's it for now. See you in the next video. Do not forget to subscribe to my channel to get more quick tips about online softwares and tools. If you have any questions, please leave us message in comment section and press the like button if you like the video. Thanks for watching quick tips.